International Trade Secretary Liam Fox welcomed a new offer from Tory Brexiteers as a genuine attempt to find common territory. The Brexit backing European research group has set out three tests it wants Theresa May to pass to secure its support for her deal with the EU. They still want a time limit to the Irish backstop, but they say they don't mind how that is achieved. Mrs May has promised MPs a vote on her deal on or before 12 March. The three tests, drawn up by eight Brexit backing lawyers, including Tories and a DUP MP, is seen as a softening of the ERG's previous stance on the backstop, which is meant to prevent the return of a hard border on the island of Ireland. They say it is up to Attorney General Geoffrey Cox, who is in talks with the EU, how he achieves an exit mechanism from the backstop. They had previously been demanding specific legal changes to the agreement. In private talks with Mr Cox, the ERG called for a legally binding mechanism to escape the backstop, with a clear exit route and an unambiguous rewrite of the language in the government's legal advice, according to the Sunday Times. Liam Fox told the BBC's Andrew Marr show, I hope it's a genuine attempt, and I think it is, to try to map out common territory. He also sought to allay the fears of Brexit backing Tories that Mrs May's offer to MPs of a vote on delaying the UK's departure, if her deal does not get through Parliament, could scupper Brexit. To attempt to have a delay mechanism in order to thwart the process of Brexit itself is actually politically completely unacceptable, he told Andrew Marr. And, as I have said before, would provoke a backlash amongst voters. He did not rule out a short delay to Brexit, even if Mrs May's deal gets through, in order to get the legislation.